Alright. Hello, 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 hello. It's time for another play something old school. Enter your name, Shadow pilot. Caster. And this is TIE Fighter. Currently in Battle 8. Defender of the Empire campaign. This is, like I said, Battle 8, Strategic Warfare. We're starting on the last mission of the campaign, which is Mission 6. That is... Trapped. As promised, it's basically... Type Defender versus... Uh, pretty much everybody. Zarin is trying to trap us. We cannot hyper to safety because of their interdictor cruiser. Not only will we lose the Magpulse technology, but more importantly our commander, Admiral Thrawn. Alpha Group must take out the interdictor before it is too late. TIE Advance Group Beta will provide an escort. We have only two operational TIE Defenders and one TIE Advanced on board. We cannot count on our forces to arrive in time to save us. Our survival is now up to you. Admiral Zarin has struck again. He has sent an interdictor cruiser to trap our forces around the rebel base we have just attacked. He has followed our efforts to gain the Magpulse technology and has now sprung a trap to destroy our forces there. Until the interdictor is destroyed, our forces will not be able to hyperspace to safety. Destroy Zarin's interdictor. Once again, Zarin has discovered our plans, but there is no time to find the security leak now. Attack the interdictor with the new Magpulse warheads so we can dispatch our three remaining TIE bombers to launch torpedoes at it. We will have only one chance of survival, and it depends on you. You will be the flight leader, TIE Defender Alpha-1. You will have one wingman. Your craft will be armed with four Magpulse warheads. This warhead incapacitates its target by disabling its weapon system temporarily. The Magpulse warhead works best against larger targets like capital ships, rendering all their defenses inoperable. Be careful though, their systems are only disabled for a brief time. Expect to face TIE starfighters flown by Zarin's best pilots. They will be launched from either of Zarin's capital ships. Be careful when going up against the turbo lasers and missile systems on the interdictor. Alright, so we are not going to use the magpulses, we are going to use advanced torpedoes. Carry two of them, but it's worth it. Star Destroyer Skelter must complete mission. Interdictor Grappler must be destroyed. There are no uh, there are no secondary or bonus objectives here, so just these two. So we we'll lock the Skelter in memory. So grappler in memory. First thing we're going to have to do is deal with a couple of these uh, 
scepters. There's a bunch of stuff with advanced missiles. Busy. The platform is gone. We're next. Hurry, Alpha One. Radio message received. Alpha One, using your target for attack. Alpha One, a cruiser has entered the area and is heading for us. And on the indictor. Take out the warhead launcher. Gone, fine, and we're gonna shield check. Alpha One, mission critical craft under attack. Use this intercept. to go quad link because if everything you can chip shot them. But for damage to the damage is what we Carrick is now in range of Skelter, so we'll start helping Skelter with that. Specifically, find some laser batteries and start shooting. It's basically got all its fire focused on the Skelter. Make these passes really effective. Alpha One, there are hostile TIE fighters heading your way. Alpha One, incoming missile. Just. Alpha One, incoming missile. And I on missiles. This they come up.
that cleared. Now it's time to start picking off. Confirm shooting Alpha One. Alpha One, incoming missile. Shooting Alpha One. All right, now we're gonna have to start taking on the graph. Just start picking off laser guns. And don't just remember to double check on the skelter. Every Actually aiming for that turret top the bridge there rather than his gun on the tank. Oh. Should go for that gun. It's about as much damage as the turrets. But the guns are a lot easier to kill. Generator, not the gun. Yeah. It's not a bad thing either. That's bad. A little too aggressive there. So now we're just going to have to a spit. She should be dead. Target disabled. There we go. Checking the target near scanning periodically. Careful eye. Yeah. 
down on that thing. That's not helpful then. Um, better hyper space out on that kill. Target disabled. There we go. Two ships left. Send me Nebula B and Vice Admiral Jones. So good. Worked out all right. Admiral Zahn, we have destroyed all the Sinar fleet systems factories located in the Omar system. Excellent. The Empire has lost most of its capability to manufacture the TIE advanced starfighters. We will continue our destruction of the Emperor's military industrial centers. Soon he will have nothing but his pitiful force to rely on. Commander Ravine, order our forces to the Outer Rim. From there we will launch new attacks against the Emperor. Yes, sir, Admiral Zarin. Yay, new shiny camp. So, 
head. Seventeen kills, including a modified frigate and an interdictor. With the help of your heroic efforts, our forces made it out of there alive. The newly promoted Admiral Thrawn sends his personal congratulations and wishes that you join him in his efforts to track Zarin down. The Emperor has commanded Admiral Thrawn to destroy Zarin's forces and has made available to him the best resources in the Imperial Navy in order to accomplish this. You are one of these resources. That just makes me all warm and fuzzy.